G'day Sagittarius, welcome back to TJ Tarot and Under. Gonna do the love energy coming towards you as it now. Let's go. Give me three cards to start with. But who's thinking about loving Saggy? Sagittarius. So this is a general reading, so take what resonates, leave the rest. If it doesn't resonate at all, you can check out your other placements. Or you can check out my playlist and see if something resonates for you there. Whoa. Okay. Got a giant thick deck this week. Just give me a workout. <laughs> Clarify cup one, please. Cross watches. This could be your energy. If not, it will be somebody else's. So please do keep that in mind. As you may not be the only one. Oh no, they want it that way. Okay. May not be the only one interested in Saji right now. Clarify card two, please. All, all the decks are pre shuffled. That didn't go on the floor. No, it didn't. And I'll list it below in the description box in the order that I'm using them in case you're interested in what these decks are. And clarify card three, please. And I'd like to get all the cards out first before I begin the reading, so bear with me. We're halfway there already. Yay! Three more for the love energy coming towards Sagittarius, please. Okay, we got them. All right, I like it when they come out quickly. And the other giant deck. <laughs> Clarify card one in row two, please. So hope you're all doing well, taking care of yourselves, having a good day, a good week, and a good weekend, wherever you are and whenever you're watching this. Clarify card two in row two, please. And don't forget to spoil yourself with something nice, Sagi, because you deserve it. Oh, yes, you do. Okay. Let me get these cards. And clarify card three in right two, please. And we can begin. All right. Like that. Energy that knows what it wants to say. Good. All right. Let's begin. Ooh, this could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. Ooh, so they think you could be the one, Sergi. Interesting. Oh, King of Swords. Mm. Oh, Nine of Swords, okay. Six of Swords in the reverse. And the Queen of Cups, wow, okay. All right, yeah, they don't want to move on from this. They really love you. <laughs> they really have a very strong feelings for you. Um, can't sleep at night thinking about you, but yeah, they're serious about this. King of Swords, that's serious energy. Mature mental energy. This is really good in the air. Mature mental energy, they're serious about this. They can't sleep at night. They don't want to move on from this. And their feelings are super strong, Queen of Cups. All queens are loving and she's the Queen of Love. That's the best love humanly possible. So, wow. Really feeling that you could be the one, Sergi. All right. You deserve love. You are lovable. Wow. So they want to give you the love that you deserve. Feel they are worthy of your love. Ooh, nine of wands. And they're not going to give up on this. Wow. No wounded warriors here. Just... Yeah, they're not going to get give up on finding the love that they deserve. <clears throat> and that's pretty much your card, Sagi, with the archer. <laughs> wow. Yeah. They're not going to give up. Not giving up. Okay. Ooh, reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. 
Okay, I don't know if that's the same energy though. Let's have a look. Oh, the Knight of Cups and Temperance. I think someone from your past might be coming in with some actions of love here. Coming to express love and they've been waiting. And that's your card, Temperance. Yeah, actions of love towards you. Wanting to show you love them towards you. They've been waiting a long time. Mm, I, don't, I don't know if that's the same energy. It could be different energy. Uh, uh, I was referred to the fact that it does say someone, someone from your past is returning to your life. Now, it doesn't have to be someone you were romantically with, even though these are romance cards, but this could just be someone that you knew in the past. It's coming in with actions of love. Hmm. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't... It's. I know it says reconciliation, but I'm told to ignore that. Just someone that you knew in the past. Okay. Full moon in Scorpio. Breathe through the tension. Ooh. I mean, it could be someone from the past. That hasn't given up on wanting to give you the love that you deserve. That's why they can't sleep at night. Thinking about you. Mm. Okay, so we've got the strength card. Yeah, breathe through the tension. So great inner strength. Release harsh judgments, forgiveness and compassion. <clears throat> so... They could feel that they're going to need to um, be brave <sighs> to get your forgiveness. Mm, this could be someone from the past. Or someone that's just nervous about approaching you. Hmm. Okay. You might have thought they were a bit of a, you know, written them off as, a, you know, as being someone you'd be interested in in the past. Like, you know, from primary school or something. Like someone that you knew a long time ago, but there was no... Hmm, okay. Full moon in Sagittarius. See the bigger picture. Okay, so they're looking at the bigger picture here. Five of Fire, the Hermit, and the King of Water. King of Cups, Queen of Cups. Wow. So it's like they've been aware of the competition which has kept them away from you and single, but they've had this love for you that, yeah, they've been holding on to for a long time so the bigger picture is that they still have this they have this love for you okay five of fire competing goals bothersome details conflict with others the hermit spend time in quiet meditation spiritual teaching self-discovery yeah, done a lot of self work, changed a lot over the years. King of Water, trustworthy, compassionate, respected, cultured. Open your heart and mind to those around you. Trustworthy and heartfelt advice, charity work. <coughs> so I think they're honest with their feelings here, they have respect. I want to open their heart to you. They've done a lot of work on themselves because of 
I think they've seen you go out with other people and the competition that they've been up against and they've done a lot of self-work here to become this beautiful, loving energy that they... Yeah. They've always held on to that love for you. Because I'm seeing the King of king of Cups here is sort of hugging that cup. I presume it's a cup he's got there in his arms. Mm. All right. <clears throat> and we have Full Moon in Gemini. Embrace the flow of life. I think they've had to embrace the flow of life because I don't think they've been out they've come forward before. Okay, Ten of Earth, wow. And the Five of Air, oh dear. Well, whichever way this turns out. Hmm. Because we've got a really positive energy and we've got a really negative energy here. So, okay, Ten of Earth, a very happy family life. Financial security, Finding magic is in the little things in life. Yeah. I'm f hearing that they've always seen you with someone magical, someone that has been like a, a dream to them. Finding magic in the little things that you do as well. Okay, and five of air, an unwise choice. Learn what you can from this situation. Review everyone's motives. So I um, see them thinking that this possibly could be a bad idea to come towards you. But they need to know what this is, yeah, whether there can be something with you or not, because um, they can't sleep at night thinking about you being the one. But there is a doubt here, but they're willing to embrace however this unfolds, the flow of life. Whether it does become this beautiful, magical, well, you know, very happy family life together with you two, financially secure, finding magic in everything that you do, or is it this just a bad idea? And they'll learn from the situation. Alright, so whichever way it goes, they're willing to embrace what happens. But I do not feel this is someone from your past, I like a past love relationship. I think it's just someone that you knew in the past, they probably had a crush on you and you didn't ever know. But they've always thought that you were the one, said so, you so. Yeah. And that's why they've never given up, because they've always thought, one day I will be worthy of Sagittarius' love. <laughs> and they've done a lot of self-work to um, become the best version that they can, so that they can come... King of Cups, Queen of Cups, so Ten of Pentacles. This could be something beautiful. Wow. All right, bottom of the deck. You are beautiful. <laughs> See? <laughs> something beautiful. They think you are beautiful, Sagi. Uh, male or female, it doesn't matter. Um, beauty comes in, yeah. I think there's some men that are really beautiful. Their energy is beautiful. Yeah. All right, what would this love energy like to say to Sagittarius, please? Did that flip? No, it didn't. Okay. We have... I'm afraid to reach out to you. Yeah, they are afraid. There's a fear. Because, you know, it could all go pear-shaped. <laughs> could all go wrong. But... You know, they need to know because they can't sleep at night. Um, yeah. 
it's going to take some courage here because they are very tense about approaching you but yeah they'll build up that courage and strength and they will approach they will come in with this actions of love they're very serious about you being the one I think they've thought about this a very long time like they've always thought that someday you will be mine. Oh yes, you will be mine. <laughs> Wayne's world <laughs> of the guitar. Um, yeah. But they've yeah, um it's nice. Aw. Cool. So you've been someone's dream come true for all these years and they're finally gonna say something. Finally gonna be brave enough. Now they've made something of themselves, that they are somebody, that they know who they are, they've grown up and, yeah, become, they're like, wow, and, you know, Saggy, it was the one that I always thought was the one, I have to go and say something now, wow, hmm, well, <laughs> this could end up really good. <laughs> you know, if not, well, that's okay. You know, they're aware of the fact that, you know, you might just not be interested. But, yeah, they're going to shoot their shot. Because, yeah. Just been dreaming about you, so, yeah. All right, well, that's your reading, Saggy. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Leave a nice comment below. That would be awesome. And thank you so much for watching. I appreciate every single one of you. All righty. Well, all the best. Take care. Good luck. And I'll catch you later.